This is Nate from the Nathan's Road in Washington blog, and I'm going to do an honest video review of the Hunt's Tomato Ketchup 24-ounce squeeze bottles. Now, as you can see in this video, the look of Hunt's Tomato Ketchup has slightly changed on the front label. And now you can see a picture of what the front label from the old bottle looked like compared to the new bottle. Now the Hunt's brand was is currently owned by ConAgra. It was purchased by ConAgra in around 1990 and the Hunt's brand was started around 1890, about 100 years earlier. And if you look at some of the bottles on the old labels, it'll say since 1890 on them. Now you might be wondering why I'm doing a video review of tomato ketchup. Well, I'll get into that later. But first, as you can see from the pictures, that the size is still the same. It's still 24 ounces in a bottle. Now in the next couple of pictures you can see the barcode is still the same from the old bottle of Hunt's Ketchup to the new bottle of Hunt's Ketchup. And I included a video which is kind of hard to make out but it focuses or shows where the ingredients list is on the back of each bottle on the old one and the new one. So I also included like kind of a couple photos of the ingredients list on the back of each bottle. Now looking at the ingredients list on the back label of the old bottle of Hunt's Ketchup, the ingredients list tomato concentrate made from vine ripened tomatoes, high fructose corn syrup, distilled vinegar, corn syrup, salt, and it says less than 2% of onion powder, garlic powder, natural flavors. Now on the new label, on the back of the new bottle of Hunt's Ketchup, the ingredients list says tomato concentrate made from vine ripened tomatoes, sugar, distilled vinegar, salt, less than 2% of onion powder, garlic powder, natural flavors. So the high fructose corn syrup is replaced with sugar on the new ingredients list. And the corn syrup on the old Hunt's label is not on the new label at all. Now I put up pictures of the nutrition facts on both the old bottle and new bottle of Hunt's ketchup. As you can see from the nutrition facts, it's almost identical. Both of them list zero grams of total fat, saturated fat, trans fat. But there are a couple slight differences. The total carbohydrates have gone up from four grams to five grams. And then there's a few other minor changes. So, but the Overall, the nutrition facts are about the same for both versions. Finally, I want to talk about the back of the label at the top. On the old version of Hunt's Ketchup, it says, Taste and believe Hunt's blends red ripe tomatoes with choice seasonings and spices for a great tasting ketchup that everyone will enjoy and with no preservatives or artificial flavors and a natural source of the antioxidant lycopene Hunt's is your best choice for a thick rich ketchup squeeze after squeeze now on the new version without the high fructose corn syrup they changed it it says now it says at the top Hunt's quality you can taste Hunt's ketchup contains absolutely no high fructose corn syrup, artificial ingredients, or preservatives, letting the natural tomato flavors shine through. 
Enjoy the real ketchup taste of Hunt's. So, overall, the ketchup is probably about the same in terms of taste and color and everything else. The main change they made is they switched the high fructose corn syrup and corn syrup to sugar and salt. Yes, high fructose corn syrup is not good for you and it's a good change to make. But what I don't like about this change is that they kind of, um, on the front of the label it says compare with other brands. So they're kind of implying that they're the only brand that has been doing this, making it without the high fructose corn syrup, but something they just started. So in a way it's kind of misleading. But like I said, it's a good thing. So overall I would recommend this kind of ketchup. And this is Nate from the Nathan's Road in Washington blog. And this has been my review. See you on the next review. Goodbye.